Here are the stories making headlines at this hour. I'm Marissa Bailey. A woman waiting for a bus at a shelter is struck and killed. This all happened at 94th and Stony Island. Mike Puccinelli reports from the scene of that crash. Chicago Department of Transportation workers are behind me right now working feverishly to replace the traffic light here at that very busy intersection of 95th and Stony Island Avenue. That's where a temporary light will be put into place so the traffic signals can be turned back on and the traffic can hopefully start moving smoothly again for the first time in more than 16 hours. It's the aftermath of a horrific wreck that claimed the life of a senior citizen who was simply waiting for a bus when she was killed at around 6.30 last night. Now it happened, police say, when this white BMW SUV while traveling north on Stony Island slammed into a sedan, a traffic light, and then the bus stop before bursting into flames. 67-year-old Janice Gilmore was standing at the bus shelter when she was struck and thrown some 50 feet. The far south side resident was pronounced dead at the scene. The driver of the SUV, according to sources, was somehow able to walk away. A passenger in the sedan was taken to the hospital in critical but stable condition. Three other people, including a five-year-old child, were taken to the hospital, but their injuries are not believed to be life-threatening. The founder and pastor of the Willow Creek Community Church retired last night, six months ahead of schedule. Mega church pastor Bill Hybels stepped down amid allegations of inappropriate relationships with adult women. Heibel says an independent investigation found no wrongdoing. And here's meteorologist Megan Glaros with a look at your forecast. 62 the high temperature for you today. Definitely milder out there. In fact, it's going to feel like it should. Even warmer than it's typical this time of the year. So enjoy the day. We've got a good mix of sunshine shine and a few clouds out there as well. 50 the overnight low climbing up to almost 70 degrees tomorrow. Another day with plenty of sunshine and we'll drop down temperature wise by the weekend, but we will have a high of almost 70 degrees right around 70 on Friday. Problem is that day will be uh, paired with some showers and storms.